good morning how are you fine ma'am what about you ma'am fine uh, so can i have your resume yes ma'am your name kalpana ma'am so where are you from i am from kanapa ma'am this currently staying in hyderabad ma'am so tell me about yourself firstly thank you for giving me this opportunity to introduce myself my name is kalpana i am basically i am from kanapa but currently staying in hyderabad Recently, I completed my graduation in twenty twenty two in food science and technology under Acharya Anji Ranga Agricultural University. Coming to my technical skills, I am good at Python and manual testing. Uh, my hobbies are listening music and watching movies. My short term goal is to get a job in a reputed company. My long term goal is to settle in a higher position where I build my career. Okay. Thank you, ma'am. That's all. Okay. What are your strengths? My strengths are I am self motivated and hard working person. How can you know that you are a self-motivated? Because uh, if, if there is, if any any person is in low, when I am in low, I can motivate myself. Okay. What are your weaknesses? My weaknesses, sir, I can't perform multitasking at a time. But in software company, you need to perform multitasking. But I can overcome them. You you can overcome them. Okay. What are your hobbies? My hobbies are listening music and watching movies. What kind of movies you will watch? All type of movies, thriller movies, action, classic. Okay, so listening music also one of your hobby, right? So what kind of music you you can listen? Mostly classical music. Classical music. Okay, that's fine. Mm, do you have done any academic project? Uh, no. No. Okay. So. Can you speak somewhat loudly? Okay. So, why you choose Python? We are having so many programming languages, like right? Yes. So why you choose especially Python? Python because it's a friendly language. I am from food technology background. I don't know coding. Uh, so Py I listen that Python we have lesser code. So it, I think it's easy to me to learn Python, and because mm -hmm. it's also a friendly language and it has future. Okay. So, what type of uh, applications we can develop by using Python? Machine learning, deep learning, mm. artificial intelligence. Okay, that's fine. Uh, rate yourself out of five. I think three point five. Three point five. Okay. Uh, what is the definition of class and object? Class is a movement of object. It does not exist physically in the real world. Uh, class is a, contains a group of objects. Object means speak in, object. Object means instance of class. It exists physically in the real world. Mm. Uh, it contains variables and methods. It contains mm. variables and methods. Okay. Uh, what is encapsulation? Encapsulation means taking data and methods in a single unit is called encapsulation. Okay. What is inheritance? Inheritance means creating a new class from already existing classes known as inheritance. What is the advantage of inheritance? The main advantage of inheritance is code reusable. How many types of inheritance are there? There are four types of inheritance: single inheritance, multiple inheritance, multi-level inheritance, and hierarchical inheritance. Okay. So, what is method overloading? Method overloading means um, writing one or more methods with the same name and say with the different arguments. With the different arguments. arguments. Mm. What is method overriding? Writing one or more methods with the same name and with same parameters. And with the same parameters. Same parameters. Okay. So where we can implement this method overloading and method overriding? In polymorphism. Polymorphism. What is polymorphism? Polymorphism means uh, it is derived from Greek and Latin word. Poly means many. Form, uh, morphism means forms. Polymorphism means ability to exist in many forms. Okay. So why we are calling Python is a dynamically typed language? Python, uh, Python is dynamically typed language because the Python interpreter determines the type of variable at the time of runtime. At the time of runtime. Runtime. Okay. So, what is the definition of namespace in Python? Name. Namespaces in Python are containers that. Uh, that that holds the class names, variables names, method names. Mm. 
What is scope resolution in Python? Scope resolution, scope resolution in Python means uh, that that determines the value in a value placed in a variable. Value value placed in a variable or function uh, in a within a program uh, ba based on location location within the code. Uh, there are two types of scopes in Python: local scope and global scope. So, what is py, uh, Python path? Python path is an environmental variable. It contains a list of directories. Uh, it, it contains a list of directories. How do we use a split function in Python? Split, fun split function is used to get multiple values from the user. Uh, it breaks the input by using a separator. Separate so by default, the separator, if, if, if any separator is not mentioned, by default, white space is taken as a separator. Okay. Uh, what is the difference between end and the separator parameters? Uh, end and separator, both are parameters uh, used along with print function. Uh, yeah. End parameter is used uh, that specifies what should be printed uh, at the end of the output. A separate parameter by default the end parameter is next line character slash n. Mm. Uh, separate parameter is uh, that specifies what should be printed between two elements. Uh, by default the separate parameter is white space. Oh, if you given white space, uh, it, there should be a space between two elements. Mm. So, what is the list? List is a uh, list is similar to array. Uh, mm. it, it holds heterogeneous type of data. Heterogeneous means different type of data like string, float, integer, anything. Okay. Can you name some methods in list? Do you remember the methods? No. Okay. What is tuple? It is immutable or mutable? Tuple, mutable. Mutable. Uh, immutable. Immutable. Okay. So, write one Python program to remove duplicate characters in a given string. Okay. Explain it. For example, if you take any string, for suppose I take Kalpana. Mm. You can take, uh, we take empty list. Okay. For every character in string, if character is not in L, it means if it, it does not present already in list. Okay. So, if, if not present in list, so we can append, then we can add it to the character. Mm. The, the character into the list. Uh, for example, up to this we get like K, A, L, P. A is already in list, so it does not satisfy the condition. 
Okay. So, and, uh, so uh, we are uh, we want to print with these spaces by using join function into the list. So finally, out, we get output okay, by spaces. Okay, so your technical uh, round is completed. Okay, uh, what are your salary expectations? Um, as a fresher, I just want an opportunity to show myself. Uh, according to my skills, uh, anything is okay for me. Okay, why I need to hire you? Um, actually, as a fresher, I learn theoretically. I want to learn practically to enhance my skills. So I need an opportunity to prove myself. I think this is the better opportunity to prove myself. Okay. So you are saying that you are having only theoretical knowledge. But when I am giving the program, you are writing the program, na? you are writing the coding. Na? Yes. So why you are mentioning only I am having theoretical knowledge? Yeah. That means I, I, I am myself now. I want to, I want to implement it practically now. Just I want to enhance my skills. Already, I think some work skills are there for me, coding skills also. I want to enhance and learn more things. Okay. So, for suppose uh, you need to work on weekends. Okay. The more work is there for the company. Okay. We need to do more work for the company. Are you willing to work on Saturdays? Yes, ma'am. I am willing to work on Saturdays. Okay. It's uh, like uh, if I work, I. I learn more from whatever. Like I feel if I feel if I feel pressurized, I okay. That's fine. Uh, but suppose sometimes the work is not completed. Okay, you need to stay overnight. Are you okay with that? Maximum, I try to finish in my time only. Now, mm -hmm. but suppose uh, sometimes we have a lot of oh, work. That's okay. 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 Uh, where did you want to see in next five years? I want to see myself in a higher position where I start my career. Okay. So which position? Like uh, team leader. Team leader. Okay. That's fine. So your interview is completed. Okay. For further information, our HR will contact you.